This year saw St Aidan celebrate 85 years of schooling excellence. 2014, St Aidan's introduced many new subjects including engineering technology, design and innovation studies, as well as many other science electives. Focus on the sciences again this year was evident with the Discover Bright Sparks Science Showcase in the Junior School and the Aspiring Women's in Science Conference in the Senior School. With a keynote address from Professor Ian Fraser, St Aidan's students were immersed in a high achieving science environment with girls from all around Australia. Once again, our junior girls excelled in NAPLAN with the top performing results in the state and the fourth best nationwide. Last year's seniors were also extremely successful with 43% of girls achieving an OP 1 to 5 and 100% of girls graduating with an OP between 1 and 15. With over 100 girls involved in the strings, band, chorale and chamber ensembles, St Aidan's music hit high notes this year. The outstanding level of musicianship across all ensembles were showcased at the gala and all groups concerts. This year also saw exceptional community outreach with the chamber groups performing at various community events. A highlight this year was the musical Oklahoma. The girls involved in the orchestra and chorus said it was an amazing opportunity. Drama also took centre stage with BBC's production providing a dark and dramatic showcase of their talents. Another highlight for the drama students was their success in the Shakespeare competition. This year has seen one of the most successful and commendable seasons for debating at St Aidan's, with the highlight being the Year 10 team and the Year 12 team making it through to the semi-finals. Another highlight of the debating season was the annual Great Debate against the seniors of Brisbane Boys College debating. This year's topic, that reality TV should be wiped off the face of the universe, saw St Aidan's representing the affirmative team and Brisbane Boys College representing the negative. The battle was closely fought, however St Aidan's claimed victory over the BBC boys in front of a hugely excitable crowd. This year has seen a continuation of sporting success. Our summer and autumn sports had a number of wins, one highlight being the cross country team who finished third in the aggregate and won the percentage trophy. The second half of this year saw a continued success across a wide range of sports, with the Senior A tennis team taking out a premiership and our rowers taking away three medals at the Rowing State Championships in Bundaberg this year. However, the highlight for this year was our success in the athletics, winning the Percentage Cup, which was the first time in St Aidan's history, and coming away with a third place in the Aggregate Cup. There were some outstanding performances from individual St Aidan students, with many selected for state and national teams. Our school captain, Libby Jarks, represented Australia at the World Championships in Israel and Cook Islands with amazing results. Year 9 and 10 students have participated in a various range of exchanges to New York, Perth, Melbourne and Johannesburg. Our Interact group embarked in the poor and worked with 40 children at the Children's Welfare Centre and raised over $12,000. Students have taken part in thousands of hours of community service. Other highlights this year included Interax Quizit, Global Shields with the MS Moonlight Walk and Mad Night showcasing the artistic talents of our students.